The Egyptian-German Development Corporation has a very long history of several decades now. And currently it is concentrating on three topics. The first topic is energy, the second topic is water, and the third topic is sustainable economic development. JCWE, our joint committee, has been active in very many different topics in the energy sector. Uh, mainly, we cover renewable energies, energy efficiency, climate change, yani climate protection, and we are also active in so-called institutional transformation. We are also pretty active in energy efficiency awareness, uh, informing the public about the potential of energy efficiency, the potential for saving electricity in the light of increasing electricity prices because the Egyptian government has to reduce energy subsidies. Prices are increasing and people are now asking for options how they can reduce their electricity bills. My main responsibility uh, in the third phase uh, um, are two intervention areas. The first one is awareness and communication. And um, in order to promote the several activities of uh, GCWE, uh, the, this component uh, serves uh, the, other, the other one. So uh, we have a lot of assignment under this intervention area. Uh, the main thing uh, are the two in awareness campaign we are doing now. We have the one for the households and the other one is for the schools. The other intervention area uh, at which I'm responsible for it is the institutional uh, reform. So based on the Christie Law 2015, the whole sector um, had to be modernized, had to be restructured. And one of our main stakeholders is the uh, Egypt, um, Egyptian regulatory agency, Egypt ERA. And uh, within its new functionality under the, uh, this law, um, it seeks support and GCWE uh, had supported Egypt era from 2015 until now with several consultancy services. Recently and finally we had a very very successful partnership with CLI, the Collective Leadership Institute in Potsdam, Germany, uh, which enhanced uh, the calibers in Egypt era to implement the new organization uh, to understand what is leadership, what kind of tools they can use in order to achieve the targets and also uh, to uh, trigger and to evaluate on a, frequ if, uh, on a frequently basis uh, their, KP uh, their KPIs. We actually have uh, so many uh, many assignments under this intervention area and we would like to start with the SAIP assignment. The SAIP stands for the Sustainable Energy Action Plan. It actually follows the mandate of the new electricity law uh, that was issued back in 2015 and it actually obligates the nine distribution companies to submit an annual energy efficiency plan for Egypt era, the electricity regulator in Egypt. The second assignment is the review and the, the update of the code. And by code, we mean the electricity dis distribution code. And now we are in the process of revising this code and also updating it. The third assignment, um, the electricity market structure, has to be it transformed from the current one to a competitive electricity market. So Egypt era uh, asked JCWE to provide them with the necessary tools and the capacity development uh, uh, missions. And this tool is the Plexus. The Plexus is a software that actually does uh, integrated uh, planning and uh, electricity market modeling. We actually successfully finished this assignment as it, it started in August to 2018 and ended up in May 2018. I'm in charge of the climate change intervention area. I've been uh, um, responsible for implementing activities 
uh, on issues related to climate change. So what we're trying to do with the Ministry of Electricity is to put together uh, programs and build national capacities to try and reduce our greenhouse gas emissions from the electricity sector specifically. So we had three main activities uh, ongoing in the past 13-14 uh, months. The first one was to try to uh, come to a common language between uh, people working in different ministries, different sectors in Egypt uh, regarding climate change. We also had an activity related to supporting the national climate measurement reporting and verification system uh, and setting up uh, a climate MRV for uh, the electricity sector as well. And uh, also we had a, a very important activity of uh, setting up a climate finance program. Um, and all of these activities are associated or accompanied with um, a very uh, extensive uh, capacity building and training modules for national specialists, uh, uh, governmental as well as from the consulting sector. Our objective is primarily focused on um, uh, developing and promoting the dissemination of renewable energy targets and mainly uh, meeting the strategic mandate of Egypt to uh, provide 20% of renewable energy by 2022 and 42% uh, by 2035. Um, our activities include capacity building measures, uh, organizational restructuring in light of the new electricity law issued in 2015, and the strategic positioning and uh, rollout program of innovative and emerging technologies uh, such as electromobility and smart grid technologies.